Hey everybody, this is for, uh, for all you guys out there that didn't like the idea of the copper and the fish water to heat it. So this is going to be my uh, heat exchanger barrel. Uh, I'm going to put fish water from a surf pump in this half inch pipe in the bottom. It's going to fill the barrel up this way. And then right out this one inch, it'll be a one inch gravity drain back to the fish system. So the barrel's going to contain fish water. And then I'm going to bring a closed loop system from my copper heat exchanger on the stove. I'm, I'm leaving those. I'm not going to take them off. I've already spent my money and done my work. I'm leaving them. So then I'm going to plumb over up the wall and it's going to go in here into the barrel where I've got stainless 3 8 tubing and it's going to, there's 150 feet of tubing in here 100 feet on the outside and then I got that pre-coiled spool in the center which is 50 feet so it's going to go around the outside of the barrel to the bottom and then back up exit the barrel I didn't make the connection inside the barrel so if, if the if there's ever a leak of the fitting it won't be in in the fish water and back around back into the barrel down around through that coil back up out of the barrel and then back to the stove for reheat and I, well, I'm hoping uh, that this closed loop system here uh, going between the barrel and the stove I'm hoping that will auto siphon without a pump so that's the plan uh, I'm gonna get it plumbed up and then I'll then I'll show it to you again